Everything shown I strictly for educational purposes. I am not responsible for your actions. Okay guys, we are back with another hacking video. Today we're taking a look at the M5 stick. Just got it in this box. So let's take a look. Now this thing's gonna be pretty cool. Boom, look at that. This is an M5 stick by M5 Stack. This thing can do, hey. This thing can do so much. Infrared, BLA, Wi-Fi, and it has GPIO pins. Like it has so much. So we're gonna be going over this, how to download firmware. We're not gonna be taking a look at the inside for um two weeks ago. Now this is actually the ESP32 itself. We're not gonna be taking it out of this case because you have to bend these GPIO pins, which is just crazy. So taking a look at this, it has this screen which Okay, so now that we've got everything put back together. You can go ahead and turn this on and figure out how to get some. One crash out later. Now, before we actually start with the downloading firmware and all that fun stuff, I want to show you something even more cool. And this is the GPIO pins in the top. So from here, you could add extensions and RF24. Here we have a light bulb. You ready to see some magic? God said. Let there be light. Isn't that so cool? You can plug in like a light bulb. Now you can plug in IR transmitters, like a bunch of cool stuff, but this is really awesome. I don't know, something simple. It's just GPIO stuff. But let's get into the boring stuff now and start downloading some cool firmware on here. This is a long process, so let's get started with it. You want to go to M5 Burner, then M5 Docs at M5 Store. You want to make sure you're clicking the real one because there are a bunch of fake ones. And then you want to go down until you see M5 Burner, or just tap it over here. And M5 Burner, I'm on Windows, so I could go over here, hit download, it'll come over here, it'll take five seconds to download. Then, once that is downloaded, we can open this up and open. And what we're gonna wanna do from here is just tap M5 Burner, extract all, extract, and just like that, you've got M5 Burner, I do find it kind of glitchy. It's going to say, like, do you trust this application? You just want to say yes. So we could click this. We could hit M, or we could hit Windows, and run anyway. Trust, guys. It is safe if you click, if you click the right website. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my plug. And you can't use any plug. You have to use one that can transfer data. And I'm just going to plug this into my computer and then plug the other side into M5 stick. As you can see, it, it says, found new device at COM13, because you do not want to flash the wrong COM. Now, this works for anything, Atom S3, Core, anything M5. You could just download firmware to it. Let's see, what's the third party? Whatever. So, there's three firmwares that are really fun to play around with, and we're gonna check out all of them, and that starts with where is it? We have Bruce for M5 or for stick plus two. We have Nemo for stick plus two. We have Cat Hack, Marauder, and Launcher. We're gonna be using this out. And Volo's projects. Now these are all really fun. So I'm gonna start downloading these. I'll show you an example of how to actually download a firmware. So for, we could just start off with Cat Hack. And I'm gonna make a ranking of what I think is the best on scale of 1 to 10. So we could go over to burn, continue, com 13. You want to hit erase because it comes with like some crap flash where you do not want that. And it'll, it takes like a minute, but. <sighs> and erase successful. And now we're going to click burn, continue, and start. Now this will be very fast actually. And then we're gonna have cat hack firmware on our stick. Now, cat hack is only for M5 stick. And if you want a tiny knockoff flipper zero, this is absolutely the best firmware for that. And I love this firmware. It looks so amazing. And it works amazing. So I'm gonna put it in A tier. Let's see. I need to make a dumb little list now. I'm gonna put it in A tier. There's not many of these that go in A tier. But this is one of them. So let's zoom in now and check the M5 stick so before, out somewhere. Before we get into all the cool stuff, this is the OTA launcher firmware. And this is the absolute necessity. 
So if you do have an SD card that you plug in up here, this is what you want, even, even if you don't. So you could go to OTA. This basically makes it so you could download without having a computer. So I'm just going to pick my network. I'm not trying to blur this out right now. And enter my password. And now I can actually download firmware from this little guy by itself. And it's so fun. So let's see. I'll look for Bruce real quick. Bruce. Options. And you hit OTA install. If you have an SD card, you hit the SD card option. And it just installs it on here. And what it has is when you first open this up, it shows the OTA screen. If you press the little button, you could go to that. If you don't tap it, it just takes you to the firmware you have downloaded, which is just so awesome. It's such a necessity. So let's see what else we could do on here. Now, this is cat hack firmware, and it's literally mini flipper zero. So there's the cat. We can go over here to the hacking stuff, and it looks just like beta flipper zero. So on here, we could do Bluetooth. Infrared sub gigahertz Wi Fi. I find sub gigahertz doesn't really work, but with Wi Fi, it's so easy. You just go to Wi Fi, the author, you could turn Wi Fi networks off, Wi Fi spam, fake Wi Fi networks, bad portal, create fake Wi Fi networks and steal creds. So fun. Bluetooth, we could send fake notifications to devices, like fake AirPods and stuff. That's just really for trolling people. Infrared, so fun. You just go to TV Be Gone. It can't really. Um, record because it doesn't have like a receiver but it has a transmitter so you are able to do TV be gone and then you just do it from what region you're in I'm in NA and it will start sending different different remotes to turn off the TVs around you it's pretty fun and that is that for cat hack firmware let's take a look at some other now ones. this is Marauder firmware on here now I don't really know um so first of all it's flipped upside down so you have to Hold it like this, which I guess isn't too bad, but I don't know. That's definitely making it go down. Now, if you've seen... It's so tiny. It's crazy. Now, if you've seen my router video, you've seen this already and all the stuff we could do, but let's go through. But one of the things I love so much about the M5 stick is the screen. Like, Flipper Zero, lock in. I want to get, like, a custom screen and everything, but we could go to Sniffers. Like, this has everything just a normal Marauder would have. So you could scan access points, which I'm not trying to blur out right now. Let me see. Okay. I got some. So now, I, I don't even know. I've never seen that Wi-Fi network I got in my life. But from here, you could go to attacks, a bunch of stuff. But I don't know. I really don't like that firmware on here. But the next one is really cool and it's actually the first firmware I ever downloaded on here. Oh, it doesn't always have to be hacking stuff. This is Tetris. And oh my gosh, look at it. It is so cute. It has a version, it has a battery percentage in the top right. And let's see, I've actually never downloaded this. It's like very new, I just saw this. But it says it's loading, let's give it a sec and see how playable Tetris actually is on this mini thing. Now you want to make sure you get the version with a uh, no handlebar, whatever, because I can download that. It says press M5. Oh my gosh, look at this. So let's see, I'll put this over here. Let's see how I can get on this. Okay, okay. Am I cooking, So you're not able to block stuff. Whatever I need to do for that. Yeah. And then I can put this there. Okay. Oh, my hands hurt. Guys, this game is not fun. Maybe in class. Not like I would ever do that, obviously. Um, yeah, let's look up to the next thing. This is too tiny and the buttons are in my hands. I'm not playing this right now. That was a long video, but very informational. The M5 stick. It's a pretty awesome little gadget to have for only 20 bucks. I can never get the M5 store working, but someday. I would just get it off eBay for like 40 bucks. I'm getting scammed, guys. But anyway, that is it. Hope you guys learned something. Hope I edited out that part at the beginning of me breaking it and having to order a new one. But I will see you guys next time for a new hacking video. Goodbye.